Jamie Carey announced her retirement yesterday. What are your thoughts on that? Well, it's kind of a sad day yesterday. Uh, you know, with uh, with Jamie, who's been here for four years, has been part of our playoff runs, uh, has played in the finals for us. Um, you know, I have real mixed feelings. I know what she's got to look forward to. I think she's going to be a terrific coach. Um, I know that in looking at our roster, she was feeling with Aaron coming back, uh, limited playing time was available this year. And so um, it was going to be hard for her to kind of get the same playing time that she's had in the past. Um, the other part of it is that she's been hurt off and on. She's got uh, coaching to look forward to. I think she's going to be a great, great coach. And so uh, if this is the time in her life where she can start um, – you know, having a, a full-time coaching career, then, you know, I think that may be best for her in the long run. Tamika Raymond might be in the same kind of position. Um, you know, she only played 10, 12 minutes a game last year uh, as Sandrine developed. And, you know, it's nice to want to keep playing, but she has a great future ahead of her in coaching. And I know that, you know, when you're a college assistant coach uh, in the summer, there's a lot of recruiting uh, time spent in July um, school starts earlier and earlier in college each year. I know at Kansas where she is, they start school uh, in late August. And with our season being pushed back where we could conceivably play all the way up till October 9th, that's only one week before regular practice starts in college basketball. And they start individual work in, in September with their players. So I know there's been a lot of discussions with her at Kansas uh, about uh, whether she really even has the time uh, to to play and really do uh, or give Kansas her full attention as far as what they need her for. So I think that uh, right now she's leaning toward not playing this year. Uh, as far as Svet, uh, Svet uh, is playing with the Russian national team, um, doesn't want to make a decision until July, and unfortunately I need to know. I mean, I know that Sandrine and, and Annette are coming because they've told me that. Svet doesn't want to make that commitment. It's just the, the way she is, and uh, we have to go forward with our team. If something changes down the road, that may happen. I know a lot of our fans are in love with her. She's a former UConn player, but our team needs to know who's playing for us this year, and she's just not ready to make that commitment right now.